this. Uh, we're in smuggling area. Why are we in smuggling area? Why are we like aimants? Curse those dogs. Oh shit, so that operate oh. So that is still in the game. Good to know. Why is it? Okay, I was gonna like is that car already on fire? I'm so riding the motorcycle. It's just the Go ahead exit out me. There. Mistakes. Made mistakes. Made mistakes. Made mistakes. Made mistakes. Made mistakes. First will be in this morning. Hello. Uh, so Chris is going to talk you about vacuuming. Ah. Um, because I'm going to vacuum my room, and so I'll leave it out for you. Okay. But, um, <laughs> Uh, that conversation's over and done with. Tarzan, you gotta get out of the car now. Right, 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 right. I shot out three of his tires and he the fucking car, that bastard. Motherfuckers want to get me up? That's bullshit. They ain't going nothing right now. Marking a captain. Marking a corpse. We'll leave a marker so the rebels can pick up these supplies later. Chill points. There's a big difference there. Well, that was messy as shit. We have an air. We got hostiles in the area. Got some sorry arcanes and some uh, super cool things, which are sour for the first bit, and then kind of cracking up again. Delicious.
got a yellow hunter. I did not have an idea that this guy didn't know I'm gonna get him out of here. I had not a fucking clue. Just gotta find it. So you can get to finishing off production quick, much faster. I'll fly. Right. Good to go. Yeah, just one more production. Ooh. Suppressed vector. Delicious. Sniper bullet for my secondary. Good, 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 good. Sniper's got us targeted. Nah, I'm gonna get the fuck down. Shit balls. Oh, get him out of there. Oh, bastard. Cartel metal over here. Go to Bridge. Sniper! Sniper! Ow. Sniper! 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 I think my topic got one though. We got a snipe! Man down, go! Man down! Get up, bastard. Over Biggie did I. Rally on me. Get down. Roger that. I'm waiting the fuck out of here. Yep, job's dead. Chopper, down, so down. Get the fuck on away from that shit. Get that to get a chop on our ass. A copy. Mm 
Get ready. Fire. Watch it, man. Shit. Get all the usual. This is... Not kill the guys. Shit, they spotted us. Amigo, you hear any good chisme about the cartel? Gracias. Awesome. Oh, that's right. Uh, there's an accessory case right here. Assholes are coming this way. What's the plan? The plan is five seven to the guts. Fire seven to the guts. Guys, mid. That works damn well. Hold up. There's a weapons case here. Nice. According to this, El Cerebro is buying loads of military grade electronics from foreign sources for his new sub design. Looks like a shipment just arrived by boat a couple of days ago. You think we should go after it? That cargo could be an intelligence gold mine. We steal that boat and turn it over to Bowman. She can have the agency's text go over it with a fine tooth comb. Yeah, why can't there be any helicopters in there? Let's go. DJ Federico coming back at you. And I have on the line Santa Blanca's resident brainiac, El Cerebro. Get better away. Morning. I like music, but. Okay. I, I just want to start off by saying that I'm a big fan of your submersibles. All this technology stuff goes way over my head, but it's so cool. The problem is breathing. Again? You, you mean like breathing underwater? No. Breathing out. Where do you think that air goes? If you do not take care of the carbon dioxide in such a close pace, the air will become toxic within hours. You may as well choke on an exhaust pipe. I wait. I never thought of that. They don't know you. You're just the entertainment, the court jester. You're there to feel the awkward silence of the conversation, to help mark the time, the passing of days. You're a distraction from the mystery of our noble work. If we could face ourselves, own not to the absurdity of our existence, we would not. Wow, else you were just laying in the buffer, huh? Yeah, we need to go on the 
because I was distracted by putting something on my head. So I'm scab for like Spotted a dormant rebel radio transmitter. Let's hit the Man. switch and get it rocking. That sure to bring some cartel muscle out to try to censor it. Get down. Rankin's ticket. Uh, that's a supply chopper. Let's hijack it and bring it to the rebels. I'm sure they'll make good use of it. I don't think we can. Cause it's like it's That was the uh, aforementioned supply chopper, but oh well. Tango down. Awesome. We're clear on this side. Looks like a data file containing a route map for a chemical shipment. We should use this to track down the convoy and take it out.
fin y al cabo ir. Be reasonable. My father's been doing business with you for the last, what, 15 years? 20 years. When your father, Señor Gallardo, first invested in the Via Vigas extraction. 20 years. And now I hear you can't make it to Agua Verde for a couple of days. What is this bullshit? Oye, Carcita. Everybody knows what goes on in Agua Verde. The cartel, the parties, the girls, the cocaine. You have to understand my position. I am the refinery chief here in Libertad. I have to keep up appearances. Jorge, Jorge, I had such high hopes for you. You were supposed to be the key speaker for our conference, Best Places to Work in Bolivia. I even had the presidential suite booked for you in Paraíso, Agua Verde. Of course, it would have come with all the perks included, if you know what I mean. Carcita, I... I don't know what to say. I don't think I can... Uh... You know what? Why don't we ask El Sueño what he thinks? I'm sure he could give you plenty of convincing reasons why you should really, really come. Espere, espere, wait. Eh, ese cuate, casita. Let me check my agenda. I, uh, I think I forgot to update the, uh, some meeting that got canceled. I might have time to visit after all. Might? Will. I will have time. I will be there. You can count on me. Excellent. See you there then, Jorge. And take care of yourself in the meantime, yes? Well then. City, considering the location. Reminds me a little bit of Houston. Everything is built around the oil refinery. Their future is bright. Be a big ass with offices here in Libertad. So I want to get this game done for Tuesday. Six sets of scope points on. I don't need that many scope points, I've still got a million. Damn, I know I kind of kidded around about how mean she was, but shit! If she's dead, they must have used fucking silver bullets! Madre Coca is survived by no one, because no one loved La Vieja Cabrona. In response to the killing, Santa Blanca and Unidad are increasing their presence in the province. All you viejas out there, be careful. Always go out hard, because you never know if you'll be next. Wisconsin Paz, pues. Ah, damn it. Ah, well. Hmm. The 
According to this, the cartel's getting their precursor chemicals from a company called Via B Gas. Looks like they cut a deal with the refinery chief to obtain the chemicals on the open market. We should have a talk with this gentleman. Hey, we got an arco with a submachine gun. Close to the dump. Hold up, they're gonna see you. I've got eyes on the captain. Had. I think I'm just a corpse. Sniper, top of the tower. Gone. Hey, we got a narco. Next to the container, see? They're gonna see you. Hold on. Away, thank you. Goodbye. Tango's danger close. No, Eyes on an Unidad grunt. Close to the turret. It's probably a small drug again somewhere, right? <laughs> this works. Let's just uh, take out the sniper. Rally up, people. Roger that. We're cool. We're cool. We got a mounted weapon. Drone is airborne. I can't see squat. A drone's being jammed. Got another tango. Tango number three. I got another. That's five. Got an alarm. Awesome. And yeah, so the car too, man. They could tell. Mm 
the fuck? Tango knows somebody's got a beat on him. Is. Five in the area, huh? I want your gun though. Attack house wise. <laughs> and major mission. Hey there. We've got the location of the cartel boss's house. It's time to pay the boss a visit. Cartel's gearing up for a supply run to some of the remote bases. Fueling up a cargo plane now. We do the rebels a solid and get those supplies for them. Take the plane and fly to a friendly strip. Nothing to it. Yeah, on the other side of everything. Karen, I saw your old pal, Lagringa. I guess you know her as Dr. Svensson. She is coming. Grenade, move! Check it out. Weapons case. This will go nice with my boots. Buckle up, people. Yeah, he's all head that way and you know the combo is up one can pull that up too. Hold on. I'm engaging tables. Cartel truck off the road. Hope the locals like the fireworks. Guess we're done here. Let's go pick an AK. 
in a weapons case. Oh, ops. We got the address for a cartel network station. Let's get on it. Ah, I can make this. El reporte indica que no hay signos del enemigo. Got a prime target for you. A massive stock of cocaine precursors hidden in Libertad. Let's take it out. What do I just got then? Is it a mi oh, that was a Ricky one. That's sweet. Civilians in the area. Watch your targets. And we can look at their socks. And then take them the away. Another tango. Yo, two cartel got close to the parking area. Okay, we're still all right. I got a Sicario over here. I don't see him. The parking area, see? Sicario sporting a mint around the parking area. Got a visual on a chemical storage site. Could be a precursor stock. 
We need to destroy it, then hunt down any others hidden in the province. How they kind of hey now, we got a group of Sicarios over by the parking area. Here's target number five. We're good, yeah. we're good. Giving yourself away. Hey, we got a narco. Point him out. The parking area, see? Okay, good. I went dead. Frag out. out. Clear. Frag out. Come in here to Culeros. We got company. Frag out. Oh, I see. Picking up this precursor stocks with slow cocaine production and Libertad to a crawl. Good. Now I'll take this plane. Sure are a lot of lights and switches up here. Hostiles in the area stay frosty. Let's run. We've got no idea where we went. sent about five tons to Sao Paulo last Tuesday. You know, my share? Something like two million dollars. I'm getting really fucking rich here, and... Okay, damn it. Hey, Karen. We've been moving a lot of blow out of Bolivia. Oh, for fuck's sake, that's stupid. Hey, Karen. We've been moving a lot of blow out of Bolivia lately. I mean, the cartel yeah. sent about five tons to Sao Paulo last Tuesday. You know, my share? Something like two million dollars. I'm getting really fucking rich here. And, and with our chain of command giving fuck all about my welfare, I have to keep reminding myself why the hell I'm doing this. When I was 16, my brother Pete OD'd on H. Choked to death. On his own vomit. It's hard to explain this feeling to a person who doesn't have a big brother. It's... Well, it's like the ground beneath your feet just disappears. You keep falling and falling. Well, I don't like the idea that shit happening to someone else's kid brother, you know? Talk about motivation, huh? a wish on a star for all the good I'm doing. Or harm, really. I mean, I, me, myself, special fucking agent Sandoval, I am personally responsible for putting tons and tons of cocaine on the street. And nobody bats an eyelash. It's crazy. <laughs> I mean, imagine if a counterterrorism agent set off a bomb on American soil. Would anyone give a shit then? Keeps you going, Karen. You're not one of those pantsuit career types, so if you believe in fighting the good fight, you better find yourself some real motivation sometime soon. You gotta have some real fuel for this game. Jeez.
fucking hell. It's good. We're done here. Rebels to send a team in later to pick up their supplies. Council tops there and there. Delicious. I wonder what the fuck Mickey's missions are. Mickey's missions are where the fuck apparently. We've got a possible location on the local Buchon's residence. Sweep the house and get me an ID on this asshole. I can actually use a skill. I need so much shit. It's not funny. I got a narco over here. Tell me where. There, next to the food container. Drone is up. I see a second target. I got a third target. Just spotted one with submachine guns. Yeah, okay, my drones, I can take it off over there. Oh, no, no, that happened. What do you mean? Teleport to my side, you asshole. like the boss's house. Let's go check it out. The lieutenant's on the run. So, then run. from inside the hacienda. Here for a chemical institute run by the cartel. 
Looks like the Duchon himself is responsible for training the students. Let's check it out. Got a chopper. How much drugs are you going to work and I get some? And whatever's been, and whatever's been destroying your ass lately. Opening fire. Building up ahead. Looks like some kind of school. That's the Chemical Institute. B of B Gas, the local oil and gas company, used to train the locals and give them jobs once they graduated. And then, of course, a cartel showed up and that all changed. Let's see if we can find the boss in there. Okay, looks like they're settling down over there. Awesome. Because that's a, I can't tell if that's noise from the or the game anymore. It's like the local Buchan. Oh God, don't kill me. Please don't kill me. I don't know anything. I swear, I'm just an assistant. An assistant to who? Marcus Jensen. He, he's the boss, you know, he runs everything. Where can I find him? He's supposed to be at the witch's market later, but I don't know when. Get on the phone. Arrange a meeting with him at the market. Tell him it's important. Then you let me go? That depends on how convincing you are. Hey. It's me. Look, there's something I need to show you. I can't tell you on the phone. Yes, it's important. Okay. He told me to meet him at the witch's market. 
case you feel the need to call him back. God damn it. Where, where did all these guys come from? Hey, video. Marcus Jensen majored in chemistry because that's where the steady careers were. Job security, health benefits, two weeks vacation, 401k. And best of all, people were hiring. Marcus got recruited right out of grad school by La Gringa. Shelter guy that he was, thought he was getting a job with the SB Corporation, a multinational pharmaceutical company based in Bolivia, which, of course, it is. He just didn't realize what the product was. But when he finally figured it out, he decided it didn't really matter. He's making more in one month than his friends make in five years. And best of all, chicks. So many chicks. Almost as important, for the first time in his life, he's getting respect. Lagringa Station Marcus at the Chemical Institute in Libertad Province. Over the past three years, he's been teaching cartel members how to produce high-quality cocaine. True, most of these idiots never made it past the second grade, but it appears they finally found a subject they're passionate about. As for Marcus, his rationalization is... Look, someone's gonna make the cocaine, someone's gonna make the money. It might as well be me, right? You are right, Marcus. Just not for much longer. Yep. Seems to be right. If only we could pick me the fuck up. Thanks. HVT spotted. Looks like the local Buchan. Let's grab him and make him talk. Who need that chopper? Stay low. Sniper. He's facing the gun at floor. The local refinery chief is bringing in precursors for the cartel. Talk to this guy and convince him that working with Santa Blanca is bad for business. So that's gonna here because I blew it the fuck up. God damn it, I'm an idiot. Yeah, there's a guy blew the fuck up. God damn it. Nope. Just to take this one. Hang on, I'll drive.
tag the truck. No, don't. Tag the truck. Good work. I'll ping the rebels and let them know where they can pick up their meds. Right next. in the refinery, Chief. Let's see what he's got to say. Oh, great. We got some uni dad coming in. What is this? We're here to deliver a message. Stop doing business with the cartel. I don't know what the hell you're talking about. Cut the shit. We know Santa Blanca is getting its precursors from you. We want you to stop. Mira, pues, this company keeps Libertad. Well, but he gets Santa Blanca doesn't get what they want, they can shut us down. I can't have that, understand? Yeah, we'll understand this. If you don't stop supplying the cartel, we'll shut the rigs down ourselves. No, Fuck off, pinches gringos. This guy's more stubborn than goddamn General MacArthur. Guess we'll have to do this the hard way, then. Saddle up, we're heading to the oil rigs. Well... We did one, huh? I have a shot. Engage. One of the oil rigs. Take it out. Looks like they're feeling fucked. It's easy. I need a new truck. More truck. Yeah, that's what's
<laughs> Look at that up, bro. There's the last of the oil rigs. Let's light it up. Huh. Who set off the horn? Last of the oil rigs. Time to talk to the Via B gas refinery chief. Let's see if this will convince him to stop working with the cartel. Job. Yeah, Rebels works. will make great use of this stuff. Far better <clears throat> they have it than the cartel. <laughs> I love making Google go fly away and have it not kill them. I've already told you the answer is no. Things have changed. Santa Blanca promised they'd keep your rig safe. They failed. The deal is null and void. If I stop supplying the cartel, they'll shut me down. And if you keep importing precursors for Santa Blanca, I'll blow up every goddamn Via B gas rig you've got left. Take your pick. What kind of fucking choice is that? You're no better than El Puto Cartel, you know that? This isn't about me. It's about you doing the right thing. The right thing? Don't make me laugh. I guess I don't really have a choice, though, huh? When the cartel sends Sicarius to kill me, he will be on your head. I can live with that. Ouch. I'll drive. 
going on making. There's got to be some intel we can dig up around here. We've ID'd the Buchon as an American national named Marcus Jensen. He's heading to a meeting at the witch market. Go find Jensen and bring him to me. all the way the fuck up. Mercado de las Brujas. This is where the locals come to buy good luck charms, love potions, or even a curse for their enemies. No shit. Eyes up. If the intel is correct, Jensen could be here somewhere. What in the hell is a guy like Jensen looking for in a place like this? Whatever it is, it ain't good. Trust me. Eyes on Jensen. Take him alive. Back off! I'm a scientist! Hands! Show me your hands. Do it now. Goddamn fascists! You've got no right! I'm an American citizen! Stay where you are and put your hands on your head. Don't make me tell you again. Yeah? Or what? Shit, hey, Jensen's I'm getting away. The LT's trying to run. Bastard. Yep. Okay. I'm opening fire on these shitheads. God, fuck you, game. Why do you do this for me, game? Why not? You know, just let me grab the motherfucker out of the car like I want to. I just had to send a try to pick the man up house and get in the guy named Hazard. Hold up. Get your goddamn hands off me! You try that shit again and I'll put a bullet in both your legs. You read me? Now shut up and move. Can't just arrest somebody for going to a fucking market. Save it, Jensen. We know all about you and the cartel. What I don't get is this. You're a scientist, right? So what the hell were you doing at a place like the witch market? Processing? Opening fire. Processing cocaine isn't just about solvents and reagents. Not the way I do it, at least. I get powder from the brujos that speed the process along and make the result more potent. Yeah? Like what? Like, fuck you. That's proprietary information. You want my secret recipe, you gotta pay for it. Never stop calling me Madonna. People say it's because they expect a woman to be blessed. 
are even some women out there, successful women, who want to ban the actual word bossy. But people who are satisfied being blessed don't act bossy. Even if they don't like the word, they don't get what they fucking want. They don't make millions of dollars. I'm a scientist. You know. <sighs> Helicopter inbound. Sniper! Check this asshole. You got no fucking right, you hear me? You don't have any legal jurisdiction here. I mean, even if you did, I'm a U.S. citizen here on a legitimate work visa. You're facilitating the manufacture of an illegal substance. An illegal substance that provides income for a gang of rapists and murderers. Not my problem. I'm not holding a gun to someone's head. I'm not making anyone take any drugs. People make their own choices. That's what individual liberty is all about. Fair enough. Take this fuck outside and shoot him in the head. Wait! What the hell? You're right, Marcus. We don't have legal jurisdiction in Bolivia. So I'm gonna exercise my individual liberty and ask my associate here to blow your goddamn brains out. Wait, wait! You got something to say? Look, can we... Can we make some sort of a deal here? Sure we can. You tell me what I want to know and I won't put a bullet in your sociopathic skull. <laughs> Fuck! Fine! Fine! I'll tell you what you want to know. That's all I'm asking. <coughs> Ow. It's 8.30. Getting dark out. I ain't drunk in the room. Ugh. Yay. But the sniper's got a zero. to become hostage to fortune. Oh, I told El Yayo we had something in common. They did. We're both too old to start over. Sorry. Me to start a new organization. You to start a new family. Well then. I'm not dead yet, okay. Good for him, I guess, but uh, it's not great. Hey. You're in bad shape. Take cover. It's Bowman. Looks like the damage you've done to the cartel's production network just paid another dividend. So. Forcing the gringa and El Yayo to start cutting the purity of their cocaine has caused prices to drop and done a lot of damage to the cartel's rep. Sucks to be them. What to do for us? We got the gringa, but Sueño still needs a dog to kick. Yayo's managing production while the cartel keeps him prisoner in his own house. Extract El Yayo to an RP. Expect strong opposition. Word is the guards have orders to kill El Yayo if he tries to escape. Roger that. Let's call the guards first. Got it. <laughs> El Yeyo's fallen out of favor with the cartel. Let's bring him in. It's time we made him an offer. 13 calls. This is Bowman. Excellent work in Libertad. Stopping Jensen has halted training in the province, and losing the supply of precursor chemicals from VV gas has crippled production. This will cost the cartel millions in lost product every day, which is gonna hit them where it hurts. Copy that. Thanks for the good word. If I get... We're displacing to the next AO now. You. 
I'll pilot. Let's go, let's go. Alright, take care of this and call it for dinner. And then come back up and dinner to the other side of the front. Uh, it's fine. <sighs> I'm going to get a very clear. So, we need to Fire. We'll go. Ready? Open fire. Fire. <laughs> I can just force him to Ready? Fire, 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 fire. I got five more tennis to take care of in uh first moment. That's my fun. Uh, this, is, this was a boring mistake. It's a boring, boring mistake. Why did I do this myself? <laughs> On the bright side, I am making forward distance. On the downside, yeah, it's going to still going. I can't even kill the parachute or anything like that. Like, I couldn't, like... This word fucking did here or anything like that. Ah, I made a horrible mistake. Why did I do this myself? I should have just God skyed me that direction for nine kilometers. God damn it. Nope. Oh, down the fuck about my phone while I fly away. I very easily fall back down to earth. God damn it, I won. Uh, so far to go. My god, I made this mistake. I have light. And I was definitely going to make it, you know, if I pound it down to that area. I was still too high up, too.
I'm seeing some kind of camp on the riverside. Lots of Sicarios. Lots of go-fast boats. This is a good spot, logistically. They can transport supplies or cocaine faster from here. How much horsepower do you think those cigarette boats got? A thousand? Think they need that much when they already own the river? You want one of these boats, don't you? Fuck yeah. Yeah, but that content is always fine to me. We got company. Stay sharp. We got a Sicario. Where you got him? Outside the ICM. This is the place. Let's take this low and slow. If the cartel realizes we're here, the first thing they'll do is kill El Yayo. Copy that. Spotting another tango. Target carrying submachine guns. Birds. I got another. That's five. We got a tango with multiple civilians around. Marking a tango. He's close to that local. That's just about everyone. That's be enough. Kill El Yayo. Man, they can't because they don't need to kill him. Besides, the guy coming in, that is. No, hear me out, por favor. Because Sueño has my family. He will 
harm them if we don't meet our promotion quota. Hold on. Grenade! Grenade, get to cover! Shit, to cover! Fucking hell! Oh, dude, you just hit a civilian! I should really know what that was all those guys in. That's it, we're vamanos. We're taking you someplace safe. I, I cannot know. leave. If El Sueño's men see that I'm Maybe gone, so. the cartel will kill my family. Someone reposted it, and it showed up on my feed. Excuse me. Oh, wait, lobby jacket. Again, the drunk. Legal coca farms. So, like, can we get some? Where exactly are you taking me? There's someone who wants to ask you some questions about your activities with the cartel. I'll tell you whatever you want to know, but only once my family is safe. You understand? If not, you may as well take me back where you found me. Okay, let's focus on the mission. So, like, can we get some legal coca here for the altitude? For the altitude, yeah. You're not having any coca. You know, first thing headquarters is gonna do when we get back home is make us piss in a cup. But the altitude, it's getting hard to breathe. Shut up. RP's just ahead. Nobody get comfortable. I get the feeling we'll be heading right back out again. Roger that. Wow. There was a lot of weird shit going on around here with La Santeras cold. The people here, the family. I should have known. CIA has brought in our own sicarios. Simon Bolivar said the United States was destined to plague the Americas with misery. Now that misery is upon my house. He says Sueño has his family. You could have led with that. These four gunfighters are your best last hope at saving your family. So are you going to play ball, or are you going to bury more kin? Save my family. Then I decide if I will talk. Ah, for fuck's sake. Yayo's family's in the cartel district of a village called Baya Floresta. We've got to move fast. So when you find he's gone, that family's dead. This is a message from the Free Rebel Force. Just killed a civilian. Hey, we're good. She's fucked up people with hands over Bolivia. Even while working with the cartel, like Man, you'll never let me drive anymore. Just because that one time? Even members of our rebel forces. But at this crucial time in our fight against Santa Blanca. Coming up on Baya Floresta. Yayo's wife and son are supposed to be somewhere in the village. Keep your eyes open. gonna make you back up.
Yo, cartel gunman. Near the food container. Can't get more ammo. Hold up. We got hostile activity. I got one narco. By the building. Deploying drone. I got a third. Just spotted one with submachine guns. He makes five. I just know that, or I was hearing from him a couple of things twice that uh, a lot of people have got stuff without him. For the great most of the team and stuff. Not giving special call outs. A lot of other people do. That pendejo is no threat to anybody. Looks like we've riled him up. Roger that. Unidad bird on patrol. Watch out. They're going after the wife and son. Stop them. Poke the hornet's nest. Don't touch me. Calm down, Chewie. Your father sent us. You expect me to believe that? You can believe whatever the fuck you want as long as you shut up and follow instructions. Now follow me. Both packages secure. Let's get them back to their old man. I got it. I'll fly. Punch it, man. This is the old man's fault, isn't it? He's too greedy and too proud. A man cannot be both. Callate, mijo. Rudy does his best for his family, for the cocaleros. How do we even know he's with you? How do we know he's safe? That you aren't used enough to get to him. Just like esos charros, esos mexicanos. I never said we weren't using you. But you are safe with us. And El Yayo is safe. I have seen the DEA and CIA do too much evil to my people. Do not expect me to trust you. Guru gringos, Kumara Mama Coca. Viva Mama Coca! De tu los blanquiñosos! Well, I should have known better than to expect a thank you. This is it. You're safe now. Rodolfo. Mirosita, estás bien? Sí, mi vida. Papa, what trouble had you gotten us into now, old man? We just got you out of trouble, kid. Don't expect us to believe that. Ustedes, blanquiñosos yankees, only bring problems to Bolivia. I may be too young to have marked with the Cocaleros in 96, but I have seen the scars on the protesters who were beaten. I'll eat a dick. I'm sick of this anti-American bullshit. We're not your enemy, kid. But you're not our friend either. Tranquilo, mijo. 
I have made deals with many devils in my time, and it has always been to protect my family, to ensure that my people, los cocaleros, survive. Now I have made my deal with you, Agent Bowman. I'm sure to regret it later, but for now, it will allow us to see another day. All right. I guess I'll go. I guess I'm gonna call on the stream once I can. And then go eat dinner. Let's see what the situation is after that. Bowman, get what you want? Nobody's happy about it, but yeah. Looks that way. Fucking ingrates. They know we saved their lives, right? All thousand. I know is the cartel's gonna have a hell of a time making cocaine without El Yayo. The rest is over my pay grade. I heard that. You cannot feed the hungry without food. You cannot heal the sick without medicine. And you cannot satisfy demand without a product. With the cocaine production in shambles, our market share was shrinking more and more every day. We increased prices, but it was a temporary solution. We would have to import from Peru and Colombia, invest heavier in meth and MDMA, a very costly and time-consuming endeavor. It would take years to rebuild. I had no choice. If workers were left unpaid for too long, there was no telling what they would resort to. But the biggest loser in all this was the people of Bolivia, out of work with no means to support their families. All they could do was wait. Wait and see who was next to take possession of the coca fields. Well, now we just gotta deal with the motherfucker. Spoke of bitches. Looks like you have to go with the bar all five smoking the jump before you can go for the underboss and then head. Interesting. With that, I'm calling the stream. I'll try to be back on after dinner. See y'all later.